Okay, uh, so we're going to talk about what seller financing is. Seller financing is an is a way or an opportunity for you to purchase a property without having to pay the full amount up front. You still have to pay the full amount, but it it's between what you and the seller agree upon on how long it will take for you to purchase the property. So if it takes five years, uh, you'll add interest to that as well. Or you can do no interest, zero, uh, you know, no payments. You can probably even do zero down, uh, zero down payment. It's whatever you choose. So seller financing can be very creative in the sense that you can work terms out with the seller if they agree upon it. So if it's, Basically, if they do zero down with uh, zero interest and uh, for example, this is what I have done before, zero down, zero interest, and we won't pay this until it's actually the property is completely fixed up. Uh, they give The seller is giving us two years to do that and then we have another two years to extend the contract. So th those are some terms, which that's like a home run term, but terms are like 10% down with 3% uh, interest. Uh, and that that's actually interest and principal for 15 years. Something like a traditional loan, but without having to go through the banks, right? So basically the seller is lending you that money for uh, a certain amount of time uh, to purchase the property. And that's what where the note is created. Um, I've added uh, some contracts in in this uh channel for you to take a look at it's seller it's for seller financing um you can also use a simple purchase agreement uh just like a wholesale uh purchase and sell agreement um you can just write down the terms on uh the other like the, uh, down below um seller financing is a great way for you to purchase a property and then you can si assign that actually you can make this assignable to an, another buyer and buyer um, basically if you have somebody an end buyer that is looking to purchase a property but they don't want to go fully down on the property because it needs a lot of work they're gonna uh, be able to purchase this property without uh, having to um, you know like go, go to use all the, all of their 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 money so if they put 10% down and let's say they can pay it off in a year they can put 10% down and then if they have enough they'll, they'll they they're supposed to have enough money to do the rehab and then they can either resell it uh you know on the MLS or whatever they want to list it or they can refinance out whatever the buyer chooses but what you do is you get the terms down with the seller and then you will uh, assign those terms or assign your equitable interest of the property to an end buyer for uh, a higher price. And let's say I get a property for a hundred and a hundred grand. I'm going to sell a an, hundred grand and the seller wants 10 grand, right? So 90% uh, of that will be have to be finan uh, financeable uh, or will be the terms 90 grand, 10% uh or 10% 10, 10 down, which is a 10,000. So, um, and then like 3% interest, right? And then, so your payments will probably be like, uh, like eight, 800 or something like that, uh, 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 a month. But you know, he's giving us a year to pay it off. So 10,000 down for 800 a month. Uh, the ARV on the property after repair value is about 200,000 and it only needs $30,000 worth of work, right? So what you can do is you can sell your that property for 110,000 because that you want to make a $10,000 fee, right? So that will still make sense uh, for you and your buyer and, and the seller because the seller will still get their down payment if you tell the seller it's a 20K uh, down payment entry and that will and at a hundred and ten thousand dollars and that will even out to where um, Basically, it's a it's a good deal for everyone. So hopefully that makes sense for you it, We can dive deeper into this if you have any questions. I'm here for you guys uh, We can dive deeper. I, ha I do have another course coming up and if you're interested in that, let me know